Challenge second, Fighting Games Challenge fourth, Head Stomper ninth, Mix Up first place. He's been very strong placings. He's fourth place on the TWT yeah, standings. that's super high up. I think he's got 600 points. That may or may not be a safe point for qualifying for finals this year. I didn't even notice that Mr. Bell was using uh, that classic Namco stick. What game did that come out with? That was Tag 1. Tag 1, yeah. But he's been rocking a Tag 1 yeah. stick for all these years. Ooh. It's a Tatsu. And Akuma, such a weird character to fight against in this game. Yeah, if you don't know, if you don't have the muscle memory or you just don't know how to fight him, man, you're just, it's almost free for Akuma, you know? And look at this work that Super Akuma cool. owns. Oh, she turned around and got him. He's like, you're not spinning around anywhere. No oh, hurricane kicks. Yeah, he spent it pretty early, though. He's got a lot of uh, work out for him. Oh, demon flip into the low, and then down four. That's not guaranteed, right? I think from that close, because he was like, had kind of the wall to his back. Ooh, floats him out. Nice conversion here. I like it. Spends Moha. Yeah, a little bit of wall. Oh, gets no. hit with the level two focus. They had to give a Street Fighter 4 Akuma. They could even give a Street Fighter 5 Akuma, man. I don't think Street Fighter 5 Akuma was a thing before he came out. Oh, yeah, we got Akuma before Street Fighter did. Yeah. But uh, this is the worst place right now for oh, Mr. Nice Bill. Oh, nice kick out of nowhere. Yeah. Well, you got to be careful. Two meters Super Akuma's holding. EXP. Side wall. Goes for advantage, DP. No, he's been keeping it. Oh, challenges oh, with the oh, counter hit 1-1. Yeah. One, one. yeah, I feel like against Akuma, your frame advantage has to be, like, almost airtight with the options that you go for after. Yeah, EXDP is, well, EXDP is frame one in the other ones are not. Ooh, Locked, no, no punish, punish. there. Yeah. Oh, oh. The jump in four, drops the combo, oh. very rare from him. Dude, oh, jump, jump around, down. jump around. That's right, Kanarina, jump around too. <laughs> Gonna be just short of the wall on this. Well, the wall person, uh, duck! Oh, oh, oh cancel the brakes on that. I think he got scared. Ooh, this, this is gonna do hella. It's gonna be just short. Oh, oh I'm wrong. That did hella Look. damage on that last hit. That's a super Akuma right there, man. Yeah. That's the build, like, man, that sucked. <laughs> it's really See character select. It's really hard to read Super Akuma's face. He always looks like he's nervous or uncomfortable. He always looks surprised to me, like, huh, I won. Or when he loses, like, huh, I lost. Where are we going? Yeah, he's definitely trying to find a more advantageous uh, stage for himself. Akuma on Forgotten Realm. That has some actually cheap stuff. Yeah, so I don't think that was the greatest choice, and I don't think Katarina has some of the best stuff either. So It's just, just decent stuff, yeah, like, but I've definitely in recent, uh, it was definitely someone from Europe that recently put a Twitter vid about like messing up King on this stage. I think it was, uh, what's his name, Goki Akuma? He's a Europe player. Uh, he put like 100% combo from mid-screen. That sounds pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> we'll see if uh, Super Can Akuma knows it, it though. Round one. Oh, I think you know him. I don't think it was Goki Akuma. I don't think that was, it was something Goki. Yeah. That's why I think that's the guy. That's why Rick started calling himself Low Goki because of that player. Everybody calls themselves Akuma or Goki or Shin Akuma Six Six Six, and then there's Jr. Rodriguez. Yeah. All right, DP. Yeah, no meter to extend it, but wow, that's the four four two one rip straight up. Is it? Whoa, what? that was weird. Ducks the string. Man, this character changes the complete dynamic of this game so much. And Super Akuma plays him so confidently. He is just, oh, once he gets that first hit, he just tries as hard as possible to stay in your face. But lots of pokes out of Mystic Bill right now. You know what I like about Super Akuma? He makes playing Akuma look like fun. Yeah. Like, I'm like, I want to jump around and just do stuff. I'm just bad at it. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Going to break the first floor. Right to DP. Down for one. Wall pressure. Oh, oh, fire. Clean meter. wall splat right there, too. And Super Kuma looking to make this a uh, quick 6 0. Oh, snake edge rip, but jumps away from it. 4 nice. 4 2 4. And that's the first time we've seen him let it rip. And I think with Katarina, you really have to test your opponent, but it's hard against Super Kuma because he's so much. He's always in the air. So, what are you, how are you going to test him? Jumps over the running shoulder charge. Ooh, no whiff punish there. He's got to find something. He's trying to use that backswing blow. Oh, conversion off the spring kick. Nice. Are we going downstairs? Yes, we are. To the wall. 
four. Nice walk. I'm gonna go to the oh. Oh, sweep gets on the board. Yeah, that's definitely Katarina's strength. A lot of these tricky lows that kind of disjoin her hurt box. So many characters uh, find it difficult to hit her when she goes into a lot of these lows, but that might not matter. An easy fall. 60% right there. The into the trap. Does nice he get it? low parry. Oh, sidewall. Oh, he tries to go back. I can do that. I can jump. Nice cancel. The classic. Oh, trades. Terrible uh, trade on Mr. Bills. And, oh, oh, man, that's going to do it. They didn't watch his legs. Down three, fireball, FADC. Low one, forward, two. fireball. Low forward, fireball. I need, the, I need the Street Fighter guys yeah. to know what I'm talking about. <laughs>